Ladies and gentlemen, I'm the commentary to yourselves as always, and we have a newcomer 20 man Royal Rumble, and we're gonna start, we're gonna get started, and I'll have it next. <coughs> uh, a little cold, but anyways, nonetheless, uh, we do have this Royal Rumble. The rules are simple. Number one and two will start. And the competitors will go. And as they drew, let's see who's their first competitor. Wow, the Terminator is number one. And this, yes, this is a CAW, not a, uh, not a DLC. But nonetheless, Terminator will be will be wrestling first in this match. I mean, the Terminator had so many so many accomplishments. The accomplishment is his uh, career. I, like no DQ call, he became a world champion and a tag team champion. Fair if I do remember. Uh, Oh, and uh, in all call wrestling, he's there. Well, that's who, well, nonetheless, with uh, who threw number two. Oh, it's all green. Oh, here goes Rock Lee, a ACW wrestler. Rock Lee, the master of Taijutsus. A former ACW tag team and Intercontinental Champion, and let's go on to be in WBW. As of course Neji, he is here. He is in. He is in uh, next league. But who is walking? But nonetheless, there's 20 competitors. Actually, you can tell right. There's 19 competitors. Only one can win a con a WBW Superstar contract. So anyways, I'm bored. Let's get started with the first. Let's start with the match. Right after this load screen. Oh boy. I have water to make sure my throat isn't dry. That's some wrestling there. I would squib. Rock Lee. Trying to push out the Terminator. Outside, can he do it? No. What a nice elbow. A table strike. The T-800, never miss, never skip the beat, look at this, try to push up, now Rock Lee, if Rock Lee says no. <coughs> Who's the next competitor, who's going to join these two, or join one of them? And Rock Lee starts to push up, Terminator, who is number three? Oh, Yami Bakura, from Yu-Gi-Oh! fame, of course, from UCCWGXT, he's the champion there. Now he's gonna, he's gonna fight him, and is it, oh no, can they do it? And no, the Terminator says no, he's gonna fight them. The governor of, the former governor of California is not pleased. And Aaron Cora is trying to get in there, here we go. Hey, push on Rock Lee. Rock Lee says no. The master of Taijutsu. Only use strikes. Only use strikes. That's all. Speed and strike. It's a great move there. Irish whip. That Irish whip. Here comes Jeff Hardy. Before he was obsolete. I'm bringing the fourth wall. Uh, I have not fixed their, uh, I have not given their movesets, but, uh, we've seen the same thing, we've seen them do, and look at this, the Terminator is eliminated by Yami Makora. Oh uh, yeah, anyways, the moves, some of the moves are fixed, others are not, like Jeff Hardy doesn't have Swanton or just a fate, he does have, like, Brian Danielson has the, the default moveset he has, so. If he wins, maybe, maybe not, I'll fix him up. But nonetheless, who is number five? 
you know what I mean, Rock Lee is trying to push out Jeff Hardy, trying to push him out. Oh, and there's another wrestler from, to from, from New Japan Pro, it's Kuni Ibushi, the Japanese sensation. Why do they call him? Oh, I'm already taking it out. I'm already taking out Jeff Hardy. Okay, then. How can he do it? And oh, big boo! Rock Lee is eliminated. What his matches has been, you know, we're not, we're not even done the wire here. You know, I'm, this is the, this is the WBW. You know, this is the newcomers were Rumble, and uh, I was gonna do it on Saturday, but you know, let's be real here. I got bored and I'm gonna do it. So, anyways, we got these two going at it. These, these three are gonna go at it. Cody and Jeff, no they're not. All I got is Monkey D. Luffy. Another ACW fame. Or one of the ACW fans we had. You know, he has a former, uh, I think, Impulse, Impulse Tag Team Champion. Hopefully this season, this next season of ACW hopes will be a good one. Hopefully, Hakeem. But nonetheless, this is not ACW, this is still BW, come on. Although I do want to see some ACW. Anyway, I could do this, but nevertheless, this is all around. You see some original, some original wrestlers and some fictional, some anime. Let's see who's doing number like seven. Yes, oh, it's Pro Jared. Pro Jared. Look at this. Oh, what a suplex! A pro Jared. It's a man of action. Or a man of fantasy. And, oh, what a kick there by Monkey the Luffy. Pro Jared sees his prey. Trying to push out Yama Bikora. And Kuni Bushi's trying to eliminate Jeff Hardy. And now Luffy's trying to join Pro Jared to get out. Who is getting out? Boy, I'm excited to end. Kuni Pushi and oh, Jeff Hardy and Yami Bakura are eliminated. Kuda, Luffy, Jared, and now Static Shock. This match is going great. I want you. We we'll need there, and oh, it's going out first is Jero's Ibushi. Ibushi is eliminated. The back wall, unfortunately. Oh man, he couldn't get that contract. Be a good wrestler though, you know. Now he's going back to the drawing board, or back to uh, New Japan Pro. Really next to you, I don't know. And oh, what a, what a springboard! And here comes Chrome. One of my, f one of my favorites in Awakening. Kind of, I played some of it, but you know, I can't want, I can't want to play the real game, you know. Playing Awakening and Chrome. Of course, it's a daughter named Lucina. She's in different colleagues as well, like this colleague, WBW, uh, I don't know the other ones right now. Nevertheless, Chrome, and there's so many fighting on other, it's, like I said, like people, a lot of people say it's going to be a cluster fuck. There you go. I say, he goes to Tama, Mr. One Punch Man. I just set my fist. This is what my favorite was on the last uh and Sarah Shock, what's he doing? Oh and he eliminated Luffy. Wow, we knocked down to the wire here. 
Are we halfway? I think we are. And Sasha. And oh! He one punched him! One punch Pro Jet out of the ring. And oh, he's. Oh, he's powered up. Oh. He comes right from Tai Chi Chasers. Now, who haven't seen Tai Chi Chasers, it doesn't. Well, the American dub version didn't. The show didn't end the right way. I mean, definitely it was shot on a cliffhanger, but it's a Korean only show. There's no English sub or anything, so I watched the English version. About 27 episodes. I think 23, 27, I don't know. But, anyways, and these guys. Well, Krom, no. About the capes. And Rai. Rushing Lex Week. Try to, try to fight, try to fight a, uh, a superhero. Now look at this! I released Butterfly Sleepbox and Chrome is eliminated by Santama. And here comes Tyson Granger from Blade Blade. He's also an ACW superstar, well, formerly. I mean, he wants to get a shot here in WBW. No, all over his fists. You know. I thought I would punch them until next week. When we're down the wire, like I said, who's gonna go who's gonna walk out as who's gonna walk out as a wrestler here at WBW? Superstar. What do they call it? And oh. Oh shoot. I always hated the head. I hate that I can see that oh I think. Tyson is out! <coughs> Speaking of ACW, we have Edward Elric and Superstars of Call. Well, he'll be. Edward Elric will be competing at. at Blood, Sweat, Blood, Sweat, and Tears. We'll be competing there in the Hell in the Cell match. I just didn't see it. I just didn't see the clash. We'll be competing against Robin in a Hell in the Cell match. And also, Tama is out. And let me finish this up. And the referee will be a Green Lantern, which that's one of the announcements that SCW and CAW. Where he comes. Scott Pilgrim, the man who fight, I think, eight or ten ex-boyfriends. And the movie's okay. It's tolerable, but, you know, I, mean, I think I like the comic way better. Or, you know, like him said, the graphic novels. But nonetheless, <coughs> <coughs> and, oh, Scott Pilgrim, oh, no, I got eliminated him. I don't know if he is in CAW leagues. He could. I mean, he is a fighter. He fought at least 10 ex boyfriends. Or, or I don't know. I don't know. And he comes Leon S. Kennedy from, from Resident Evil. Too bad it's not Jim Valentine. Same. Or Chris Redfield, so there's Oh Right and Static Shocker out. It oh complete shot. These guys are going to be fighting. We have Anakin Skywalker. Now let's see. Now let's see. Super Shows a car wrestler. No, yeah. oh, Scott Pilgrim is out! And who is going to... 
Look what's happening in the brain. It, what is this? It pop up power bomb. Pop up power bomb. That sounds fun. <coughs> That's UDT. Right? I don't know that one. A former alchemist. A former longest reigning defendant, longest reigning. C-A-W uh, champion, you know, Stark Revan. Now Revan is definitely a newcomer in the Call Universe. Okay, eliminates. He eliminate. Anakin, and I think he dead. Oh, he got caught! Right, he got caught! Pop up power bomb! And. Oh! oh. What is that? Oh, well, it's creepy. It's crazy, but. He was told you. Oh, look at that! Look at that step breaker. So he's gonna send Raven to Georgia land. Here, you better bring him the bat. <coughs> what is? Is he really? Oh my God! He eliminated. And he walked into a complete shot. Giorgio. What should we do here? Oh, what a suplex. The strength with ease. Oh, he got his wave. Fuck, and he got killed. We're part of the Jaegers and uh, in the Night Raid faction in ACW. And I kind of admit, I do want him in the roster. I literally do. To finish that set of the Night Raid faction. And. And. Giorgio is eliminated. Wave. Because if I if he, if Wave ever come and join Nitro, and there will be possibly Wave the Lubak and Akami in our roster. Wave is Wave with the power, the big man. Oh, Suko. Suko's number 20. And I actually, to be honest, Suko. So, and here comes the final three. Zuko, Wave, Leon S. Kennedy. Who's walking out? No. Hey. Here we go. Try to take a Zuko. <coughs> And also breaking news in WWE, uh, Nick, uh, next league cited, of course, Jaden Yuki from Yu-Gi-Oh's GX. He was in next league so long that I think it's time to move up to the main roster. This time of year, Hardcore Holiday will never be the same again. A lot of hardcore matches happen. Right, for the velocity title, we have a street. We have a street fight between Juliet and Drew. Uh, for the world championship, we will be as Ketchum will taking on. Oh, what a power bomb! <coughs> taking on uh, Terry Bogard in a in a hardcore match. And then we have uh, the hardcore title will be defended, and it will be Ket. It will be the, the, the new champion. New champion. And anyways, ladies and gentlemen, Wave Leon, who is walking out? Uh, oh yeah, they tried to fight back. Here we go. Here we go. And look at this. Oh. 
They're on top. Oh, oh my God! No way! No way! No way! Red chariot. He's trying to, he's trying to ask me to get up. I think it's over for. Oh, oh. Oh, can he do it? Can he do it? He's so close. Oh, did he do it? No. Yeah, Connor nailed it. Oh, he's gonna hit it. Can he hit it? Make it dead. He calls this the Resident Evil. Duh! The Resident Evil power bomb. How oh, can he do it? Oh. Slap. Oh my god, can he do it? Leon! Did it! <coughs> and it's over. Excuse me. It's over. Well, ladies and gentlemen, Leon S. Kennedy is going to be in WBW. I don't know why I was saying the matches. One of the biggest matches, one of the most dangerous match, a real kill match between Hardcore Justice lost his title last night against I, Professor Oak. Professor Oak vows to injure, to destroy Harko Justice. Why can Harko Justice win that match? And also, Leon Kennedy will announce who, what brand is going to be joining. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Andy Gonzalez, the commentator. And I'm going to say one thing. Dreams do happen.